The Rolling Stones released Hackney Diamonds this month, their first album of brand new original songs in 18 years. However, leader Mick Jagger just disclosed in an interview with Francis Brut TV that the band is already nearly finished with a follow-up album. The 80-year-old rock icon stated in the Brut interview, we've recorded more than half of the next album. In this session, we recorded 23, 25 songs for Hackney Diamonds. In the near future, I plan to record more songs and create a follow-up album. Hackney Diamonds is a 12-track album that was produced by a number of well-known musicians, including Lady Gaga, Stevie Wonder, and Paul McCartney. When asked how those musicians ended up working with the Rolling Stones on an album, Jagger replied that they were all in Los Angeles recording Hackney Diamonds recordings at the same time as his band. Paul McCartney was working in Los Angeles. It was a coincidence, according to Jagger and in Los Angeles was Stevie Wonder. Andy Watt, co-producer of Hackney Diamonds, is a friend of his. In addition, I speak with him on the phone. Regarding Lady Gaga, she was occupied with work in the adjacent studio. However, that is all, they only existed. While Lady Gaga and Wonder provided the vocals and keyboards for the gospel-slash-soul-inspired song Sweet Sounds of Heaven, McCartney played bass on the punk-influenced song Bite My Head Off. When the brute journalist asked Jagger to name his favorite rapper, he mentioned Dave, a young artist from the United Kingdom who was born in almost the same neighborhood as me. Apart from Dave, he continued, there are many, many very good rappers. Jagger also disclosed that during the Hackney Diamond sessions, he recorded a song with rap influences that might be included on the upcoming Stones album.